Let me tell you this. I mean, um, we got five dead. One one person was pregnant, so we probably lost six lives. Um, yesterday, the, the the murders were planned. They were calculated. Brutal. Um, we haven't seen something like this for quite some time. If we've ever seen this type of uh, planning in terms of uh, taking taking life, so guy comes from my right to, to your left with a 40 caliber handgun, and what he does is he moves a relatively short distance along this fence and he's moving people towards that door and that opening uh, at the end of the fence. There's a guy already down there with a, a 762 caliber weapon and as they get into range he's shooting high he shoot their headshots. So it was premeditated, it was calculated, it was planned. Uh, it's it's just a brutal murder. It's one of the most brutal I've seen. You know I've been DA for 18 years. I haven't seen something like this during my tenure. My daughter Shinetta she has two children. She has an eight-month baby. She has a six-year-old son. And she was pregnant, eight months pregnant. And I have to tell her two children and, and make sure that they know the memory of their mother. My niece, Tina, she has five kids. She was a hard-working woman. All she knew was work, and one day she decided to enjoy her family because she never get to enjoy it. She lost her life. And for these shooters out here that's taking these innocent lives, you just didn't take innocent lives. You make children lose their parents. You got to stop it now. Whatever you do, put it down. It's not. Even, it shouldn't even be that 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 important to have to take somebody's lives and make these children have to grow up without their parents.